You cannot even show me one Bitcoin. Gentlemen, this is... What's up everyone, it's Adam from FWCI and I don't know what this is, it's called the Bunny and the Goat ESPN 30 for 30. It's like a Space Jam 2 promotional video, goes for 6 minutes. I can't wait to check this out. Any new Space Jam 2 stuff that comes out, I'm going to be all over. So, let's check out the Bunny and the Goat ESPN 30 for 30. I've seen a lot of basketball, but I've never seen anything quite like this. LeBron teams up with Bugs Bunny. Sounds like a fairy tale. Sometimes fairy tales get dark. <laughs> Rachel, you think whatever Toon it is. Squad, Looney Tunes, funny, funny, ha ha ha. No. Is that Candace? That team was all drama. This was easily the biggest challenge in my career. <laughs> Tantalizing story, ain't it? All right, before. All right, before we get into the full thing, um, I'm loving the fact they went and got all the ESPN guys. But basketball fans out there, Richard Jefferson is a player that used to annoy the hell out of me when he played. But he is so entertaining on like ESPN and stuff like that. So uh, I'm loving this so far. Basically, what happened was an Kid evil algorithm took my son, took that personally. Oh. Yeah, I don't like that term evil, but can we say sinister or maybe nefarious <laughs> and egomaniacal? <laughs> so I had to team up with the Looney Tunes in another dimension so I can get my son back. All right. Simultaneously saving the Looney Tunes in their world. Hang on a second. Are we going to like see the whole plot of the movie here? What's going on? Simultaneously saving the Looney Tunes in their world. LeBron needed help. The Tunes needed LeBron. It just made sense. Kind of. We needed someone who could play ball and act. Muscly weapon. <laughs> but uh, one out of two ain't bad. As head coach and general manager of the Toon Squad, I take 100% full credit for everything LeBron James. I mean, I knew this was going to be an uphill battle. <laughs> Granny's out here Definitely. having a martini at halftime. Haters gonna hate. Even great teams struggle Granny. initially, and the Toon Squad was not a great team. Things were rough early on. I could tell by the tweets. LeBron. What do we got here? LeBron, I don't want to be here. Put some respect on my name, Bugs. Just as a kid from Akron is not supposed to be here. This is the wrong dimension. Richard Jefferson, what would you do? It's all fun and games until the buddy got the carrot. Richard Jefferson, come get me. Jesus. Never watching another cartoon in my life. Hashtag washed bunny. Damn. Bun and Bugs, they weren't quite seeing eye to eye. There's no way Bugs and I could ever see eye to eye. He's like four feet tall. <coughs> Bron just loves those high jokes, but talk about punching down. I'm the face of this team. It's called the Toon Squad, not the Bron Squad. <laughs> so cute to watch them bicker when everyone knows this is Lola's team. The chemistry wasn't there. Rumor was Coach Daffy was on the hot seat. There's no I'm sure he way was. I was gonna be the lame duck here. I heard Bugs called LeBron the Wash King, and I think Bron took that personally. Oh, the king thought I'd just bow to him, but he don't What's know me very beef? well, do he? Something had to change, or they were all doomed. The goons. All right, let's find out more about the goon squad. squad. The team of your nightmares. Nightmare is right. My Anthony victim. Davis will haunt my dreams. LeBron, he created the super team. We just perfected it. When I put this team together, uh. <laughs> me, Dame, Diana, Neca, Clay, all on one team. That's all, folks. The That's team all. Have crazy powers. <laughs> hey, Diana Taurasi. The White Mamba. See? I'm not the only one who calls me that. <laughs> Damian Lillard, we know it's always Dame time. Neca Ogwumi. Nice. I like to think she picked up a thing or two from her sis. Cheney doesn't have six arms and spider powers, last I checked. Clay Thompson. His shot yeah. is wet, but and it's fire. And it's fire. Yeah, boy. But it's also wet. <laughs> this is the toughest team that Braun has ever faced. The goons Who's are unstoppable. <laughs> Algie doesn't miss. Any other teams need some help? All right, I'm just going to say, like, I feel, I really feel like we're seeing so much of the movie here. This kind of sucks, to be honest, but I, I love learning more about this. So let's just go all in. 
Oh. LeBron is one with all kinds of teammates. Mike's secret stuff. They're usually professional basketball players, though. Braun is a born leader. Not J.S. Smith. This had a lot of characters. <laughs> oh, yeah, real inspiring leader. We're all witnesses. Ugh. I mean, I felt like I could put the tunes on my back. Like, physically. They're pretty small. Insulting. <laughs> <laughs> And true. <laughs> have to figure out how to utilize their various skills. Come on. Whoa. Maybe <laughs> skills is the Dame's wrong like, word. <laughs> Makes it sound like LeBron had to save us. We're the best teammates he's ever had. Why is our voice deep? People slept on that roster. But AJ the tunes doesn't like were it. deep. Bugs, Lola, Tweety, Sylvester, Porky, Wiley, Speedy, Taz. Who takes the last shot, though? I mean, LeBron, he's going to be doubled. And we know he's going to make the right play. When it's crunch time, the ball is going to be in my paws. Oh, These yeah. white gloves were made for hitting game winners. Oh, boy. I'd give it to Not Lola. The tension was real, even if the players were cartoons. What is the key to bringing this team together? Two words. Lola, Bunny. Because yeah, Lola's a beast. <laughs> Man, that's cold. You know, they'll love the sidekick label, but we'll let it go because of LeBron. Lola Bunny, so much respect. She's a hooper I want to grow up to be. <laughs> Lola. I love the fact that all the basketball players are like, yeah, Lola Bunny was a badass. Because in the first Space Jam, she was the only one on the team that could, like, that could actually ball, you know? Made that team click. But LeBron was playing for something bigger. The driving Come motivation for LeBron Welcome has always jail. been and will always be his family. Oh, uh, kind of schmaltzy, ain't it, Doc? <laughs> my son is everything to me. He's more than just a name I write on my sneakers. Oh, brother. LeBron's played in big games, but never with his son at stake. That would normally be frowned upon. Now that's pressure. I'd do anything for my kids. In this case, I have to play basketball, which is convenient. And I'd do anything for a wheelbarrow full of carrots. Can we win one of those? I thought we were done with the legacy talk, but here we are again. LeBron versus another unbeatable super team. How many more defining <laughs> moments can this man have in his career? Not one, not two, not three. Y'all, this game is going to come down to the bunny and the goat. You heard me right, the goat. And the nickname. What's up with that? I understand why you're going with the goat, but the bunny? That's the best we could do? Bunny, goat, duck, buck, doesn't matter. We're so LeBron's the goat now? save my son. Oh, yeah. We'll see about that. Ooh, I do love a cliffhanger ending. Toons versus goons. Winner gets LeBron's son. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Here's your chance. <laughs> do your... <laughs> I'm telling you, man. Richard Jefferson is quality. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Hanger ending. <laughs> Toons versus goons. Winner gets LeBron's son. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Here's your chance. <laughs> do your dance at the Space Jam. <laughs> it's your chance to do your dance. Oh! Yikes. <laughs> Classic. Oh, yeah. Here we go. July 16th. So close. It's right around the corner. Yeah, I'll be uh, definitely going to get me some Space Jam 2 when that comes out. I'm so pumped for that. All right, they didn't show too much of the movie there. They showed a lot more, and I guess it's a six-minute video about that movie, so they're probably going to show a lot more. But damn, I'm so pumped for that. We got to see a lot more of the uh, the Goon Squad as well in this. Let's have a quick quick look at the, the guys. So there's AD with the crazy, like, you know, uh, hawk wings or whatever it is. I'm, I'm digging that because he does have unnecessarily long arms to be completely honest and we got Dame Lillard I actually picked up a LeBron Space Jam 2 action figure the other day with the uh, the Dame Lillard guy I want to try and collect all of those keep them nice in the box for all those people that collect and would see my unboxed action figures I understand your pain I do have some in a box as well uh, yeah that uh, character looks badass got the white mamba that was that, uh, uh, Tarazi, is that her name? I, I'm not too familiar with the WNBA girls, but yeah, that's a cool looking character. We got the Spider Girl, which is, uh, I'm not sure, that was one of the other WNBA chicks. And then old Fire and Water, Clay Thompson. That's really cool, by the way. I hope they do some cool, like, you know, collectible stuff with that character there. I love the Fire and the Water. That's such a, a neat kind of uh, uh, nickname to give Clay, but 
I'm so pumped for Space Jam 2. I can't wait for the next month to hurry up and get done so I can get down the movies and watch it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments about the bunny and the goat ESPN 30 for 30. I love this. This was so meta. So much fun. Richard Jefferson very quickly becoming my favorite NBA personality to watch, you know, talk about the game. Uh, but yeah, keen as for that one. So let me know what you guys think. And as always, everyone, be well, stay safe, look after your friends. See you in the next video. Peace.